In this video we'll briefly discuss what is a tenolol. How it works, what it's used for, the dose and side effects, drug interactions, contraindications and precautions. A tenolol belongs to a category of drugs, called beta blockers. It works mainly by blocking beta-1 receptors in the heart leading to decreased heart rate and force of contraction. And that also decreases blood pressure. Atenolol is available as 25, 50 and 100 mg tablets. And also available as injection. It is used in the management of hypertension, used alone or in combination with other drugs. Angina pectoris resulting from coronary atherosclerosis. Acute myocardial infarction and ventricular arrhythmias. The usual dosage of this drug is 50 to 100 mg per day. It is contraindicated in case of cardiogenic shock, asthma, congestive heart failure, unless it is secondary to tachyarrhythmia treated with a beta blocker, sinus bradycardia and AV block greater than first degree, and severe chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. Use with caution in patients with the following conditions, diabetes, kidney disease, liver disease, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, and peripheral vascular disease. A tenolol may cause fatigue, headache, and impotence. And it may also cause symptomatic bradycardia, congestive heart failure, and pulmonary edema. Drugs that increase effects or toxicity of beta blockers include and those that decrease effects of beta blockers include full effectiveness of the drug may not occur for up to one to two weeks after initiation of therapy don't suddenly stop the drug it should be tapered slowly before stopping to prevent rebound symptoms and adverse effects so contact your physician if you want to stop the drug for any reason if your pulse is less than 60 beats per minute, contact your physician before taking the drug. Caution patient to avoid sudden position changes, to prevent orthostatic hypotension. If you are a diabetic patient, you should monitor your blood glucose level closely. Inform patients that medication may cause increased sensitivity to cold. Instruct patients to report the following symptoms to their physician. Difficulty breathing swelling of feet, legs and hands, irregular heartbeat, altered mood or depression. Advise patients that drug may cause drowsiness, and to use caution while driving or performing other tasks requiring mental alertness. Caution patients not to take over-the-counter medications without consulting their physician. And finally inform patients that frequent follow-up appointments with their physician are important to adjust medication dosage. That's all for this video. Subscribe and click on the bell icon for more animated medical videos like this one.